Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. I currently just bought the iPhone 10 and I got a whole bunch of cases to go with my iPhone. So I wanted to do a quick video on my little collection and just a small walkthrough on my brand new iPhone 10. So first I'm going to start with my case mate cases. I got two brilliance cases one in iridescence and one in champagne gold so this is a champagne gold it's like a really light gold and then this is my iridescence one it's almost like mermaid it looks so much better in person but um yeah the camera doesn't no justice so i'm going to try it on my phone it comes in two pieces a little sleeve and then the actual blinged out case so you want to put in the sleeve and then the bling hard shell case and this is it um it's very durable very sturdy um it adds a little weight to the phone which i actually like because sometimes I just like to have a solid thick phone. Um, so next I'm going to show you the iridescence one. It's actually so pretty. Like this one is nice, but the iridescence one is so much more prettier to me. I like the whole like colorful vibe of it. So this is the iridescence case by Casemate. It's the Brilliance collection. I just think it's so beautiful. It's so nice. Um, these cases cost $80 each. They're really expensive, but I really love the bling. And I like to wear these when I'm like going out somewhere. And then I also bought six cases from Velvet Caviar. If you don't know, really know about them, they have an Instagram page that you can go to. And um, they have so many cases and so many different styles. But these are the six I chose to start with. So I'm going to show you the orange camo because that's like my favorite one. My favorite. So this is the orange camo. It's so it's matte. It's not glossy. It's so nice. I love this one. This is my favorite one out of all of them. And it has like a little lip here. So that way when you lay your phone on its front face that it doesn't really like touch the screen so it doesn't get scratched or anything which i thought was pretty cool it's very durable very protective i really love their cases and it's so cute too i got a pinkish camo case as well this one is like purples and pinks and burgundy i thought it was really nice i really like this one a lot and it has the lip like I said. And inside of every case, there's like suede, which is really nice. It's really nice added protection. And then I got two marble, two hologram marble. So these both reflect hologram. And these are glossy. They're like really shiny. You can see the reflection. They're really shiny. So I'll try on the black one. This is the black one so pretty and it's all around it's so nice so nice and it's really it's really protective and it's really slim which i really like this one's not bulky at all it really feels like i'm holding my phone naked like it's, i love it and here is the white one snaps right on this is the white one i love it and it's like rainbow love it so much this then i got two floral kind of ones this is my second favorite it's like a blush pink and then it has like roses all over it but it reflects red if you can see i'm not sure if you can see i don't want to blind guys but it reflects red which i love and then the lip is blush pink which looks really cute on the black and then my screen actually matches this one. And it says, your time is now. I love this one. This wallpaper. Love it. It's like pink marble. And then lastly, for Velvet Caviar, I have this other floral one. And it's this one's matte. This one's glossy. 
This one's matte and it has like gold reflex, which is pretty cute. And then it has like the pink flowers with the purple. It just goes so well together. And then this lip is black around the face, which I really like. So I love Velvet Caviar. It's my first time purchasing with them and I'm not disappointed at all. It's everything that I thought it would be. I love it. And then I got one case on off of Amazon. And um, it's just a regular glittery case. It's very flexible. It's not protective at all. I actually don't re recommend this one at all because it's so thin and like it doesn't have the lip like the casemate and the velvet caviar does. And it's just, it's just just cute. It's really glittery and sparkly. I thought it would look nice on my silver, but it does cover the. It is it has plastic on it, so it doesn't really. Sh it shows the apple sign, but you don't really can you can't really feel the phone, so which I thought was really cool too. So um, I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about the phone, because um, I know a lot of people are contemplating about getting it. So the first thing I want to mention is the notch at the top. I actually it doesn't bother me at all. I actually wasn't going to buy this phone because of that notch right here but um because i thought it was really not cute at all and then after a while when i got the phone i barely even see that notch like i'm always looking here so like this up i don't really see it at all um to get used to it was hard to get used to the control center being up here because i'm so used to swiping from the bottom up or whatever and then your notifications are in the middle which is cool the face id i like a lot i actually like it better than the fing fingerprint and it's easily easy to get used to so um like if you look right now it is locked but if i look at it with my makeup done it becomes unlocked so it really it really detects your face very well and then if you swipe up it just opens up everything and it just flows so nicely i just love it so much i love it um if you want me to do like a what's on my iPhone 10 video, I would be more than happy to do so because I have a lot of apps and I use every single one of them. So, yeah, the screen is so different. Like the quality of the screen, the colors, everything so vibrant is so different than all the other iPhones. I've had every iPhone since iPhone 4 and like iPhone 10 is like a super upgrade from where I first started and I just love it. I love it. When I changed from my iPhone 7 to this phone, I totally saw the difference in the screen quality and everything, the feel of it, everything. Like, it's not as slippery as the iPhone 7 because it was like matte and it was very slippery. This one, you can actually grip it with your hand. I really like that a lot too. I don't feel like it's going to slip out of my hand if I don't have a case on it. Uh, right now, I do have a tempered glass protector on the front of my phone for added protection. Um, I really love this phone. Oh, another thing that I really like too is the animojis, which I thought was really cute. So I sent my best friend the monkey animoji this morning, and I'll show you how it looks. Good morning. God is great. He is excellent. Yeah. So I thought it was really cool. I love it a lot. I love it. And um, it's just an added bonus to having the iPhone 10, And I think it's really a cool feature. Um, also, with this I like a lot too is the camera. So I took a few of the portrait mode photos with the front facing camera. And they came out really good. So this one I did with the stage light. came out really good and then this one I took with contour lighting and it came out really good and I really like it a lot it looks just like my Sony camera photos and I really like it a lot um also this phone is very thin very thin like just look at that it's so thin I love it it's so thin the stainless steel is like an added bonus it's so nice so nice it's so nice I love it and the back isn't really silver it's really white i don't know why they call it silver but it's really white and i really love that a lot um yeah so if you guys want to see more videos like this my collections i have like a like a really good size makeup collection i love stationary things i love cases i love everything like everything girly i have it i love it and um i would love to make more videos like these in the future so just give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i will most definitely see you guys later bye